Moving on now to dividing fractions. Let's give it a whirl. And let's try a couple. First one, two over three divided by five over seven. So how do we do division of fractions? Well, two over three, it's very similar to multiplying fractions, except we need to do one little step first. What we do is we turn the division sign into a multiplication sign, and we turn the second fraction upside down. 7 over 5, okay? We do the reciprocal, we turn it upside down, we invert it. Then we just do regular multiplication. Pretty straightforward. 2 times 7 is 14 on the top and on the bottom. 3 times 5 is 15. Over to example 1b, let's give this one a try. 4 over 11 divided by 5. Ah, uh, this time. How do we do division by 5 with fractions? Remember, we need to turn the 5 into a 5 over 1 first. Now be careful here. I haven't actually done any division yet, have I? I just wrote the 5 as 5 over 1, and the division sign just stays there. Now we're going to do the division. 4 over 11, the division becomes a multiplication, and now let's invert the 5 over 1 to become 1 over 1. 5. Now let's do the multiplication. 4 times 1 is 4 on the top, and on the bottom, 11 times 5 is 55. Can that simplify? No, I don't think so. Final answer, 4 over 55. Just a couple more, and we should have the hang of it. Next one, 3 over 10 divided by 4 over 5. Let's give this a try. 3 over 10. Turn the divide into multiply, and then 5 over 4. Hmm, quick check, can we cancel anything? Yes, we can, we've got five and 10. The five and the 10 can cancel. So, five goes into five once, five goes into 10 twice, as both of those numbers are divisible by five. Pushing on, three times one is three, and on the bottom, two times four is eight. Answer, three over eight. One more, 12 over 21, Divided by 9 over 14 is going to become times 14 over 9. Can anything cancel this time? Yes, I think we can divide by 3. 3 goes into 9 3 times. 3 goes into 12 4 times. On we go. Equals. 4 times 14 is... Uh, uh, you can cancel more there first. Are you half asleep again or what? Oh, we can too. I think that just saved me. Uh, 14 and 21, ah, oh, they're both divisible by 7. How did I not see that? 7 goes into 14 twice, and 7 goes into 21 three times. Now let's finish this off. 4 times 2 on the top is 8, and on the bottom 3 times 3 is 9. Ah, final answer, 8 over 9. How did I miss that? Still in the mood for dividing fractions? Try example 2. Give these 4 a try. Uh, what do you do with a 4 again? I forgot. Put your answers in the comments and thanks for watching.